All right, today we're going to be changing the armature on an early style windshield wiper motor and making it 6 volt to 12 volt. First, you want to remove the nuts that hold the wiper motor like that. And then the wiper motor will actually go ahead and kind of drop down. You will just need to go ahead and slide the wiper motor a little bit to the right just so you miss this little bracket here. And it should drop down just enough so you could clear the housing. And then once you do, you push that lever back, take the cover off. So you can see there's usually a little rubber grommet that's a rubber gasket. Sometimes it gets kind of old. You could still kind of use it. You can glue it. Looks like someone's done that before. And set it to the side. And you notice that this right here is what you want to get to. This is the armature. And the new armature, uh, this particular one is made by Wolfsburg West, looks like this. So that little booger goes inside there. The old armature is held by screws right in this area, two little screws. So you use a small flathead screwdriver. There's one there and one down here. So once you remove those two, it should come out easily. Okay, so once you get the two screws off, this little mechanism here is going to come off. However, there's a spring here that you want to be careful that it doesn't go slingshotting. It's held on by both ends. You're going to have to go ahead and be careful with that. Once you slid it off, just be careful and make sure that you don't mess up any of the wires. The last thing you want to do is go ahead and rewire this booger. So just kind of set it to the side. By the way, make sure that your battery is disconnected. You don't want any surprises. Once you have access to the armature, slightly spin it a little bit because there's a gear at the other end and go ahead and pull it out. And say goodbye to the six volt unit. If there's enough grease on there and you think there's, uh, there's enough lube, go ahead and put the new unit in. You can see it's magnetic. <laughs> So it has a mind of its own and goes right in and then you are good to go. Now just reverse the process and install it and you're golden.